All right, welcome back to SRD Plays Diamond Dynasty. Continuing on with the pitcher event, this is game seven. Last game, I pulled out a one nothing win with Dennis Eckersley going the distance. Uh, this time, my opponent is the Florida Gators. He has Tim Linscombe on the mound, and I'm the home team. And I have James Paxson, who I do not imagine will be uh, in the game for very long because I, for some reason, I, I just cannot pitch with him. So we go straight to the top of the first inning, playing it at my home field in Chicago. Hopefully I'll be able to uh, control packs a little bit and get the pitches down, but uh, from previous uh, times using them, it just ha I have not been successful with them. So we start off with uh, Jonathan Villar, and he just flies out to right, so not an issue there. Right out the Mark Trumbo. And next up is uh, George Springer. Trying to mix up my pitches as much as I can, and I get him to fly out hard to center field. So I did not really fool him. He really hit the ball hard. So I, it's one of the things I worry about. Then uh, Cody Bellinger comes up, and uh, I got a high fastball, and I strike him out to end the first. So no score at the end of the first. And uh, Jackie Bradley comes up, and he goes down swinging to start the inning. Wilson Contreras comes in. He doesn't do a whole lot better. He ends up popping up to second base. Easy play. And then uh, Mark Trumbo comes up. So he had one home run for me, but he's been pretty consistent. But uh, this time he just uh, grounds out to third base, and that's going to be the third out of the inning. So. We go on top at the top of the second, and uh, in comes Big Aaron Judge, and uh, probably his most, one of his most dangerous players on the team. And uh, he singles to right past the first baseman. Uh, he doesn't go any further than that. He holds, uh, I probably would have gone for second, but he held up there. So uh, pretty decent throw in, but he probably, you know, I should have just cut it off. But Jake Lamb comes up, and... Uh, Dangerous hitter, very dangerous. And I get him to fly out to the left. And, uh, yeah, so uh, Judge goes back to first. So that brings up Miguel Sano. Big Miguel Sano. And uh, I did not fool him. He found a pitch to hit, and he ended up single- uh, to the left, putting runners on first and second base. So, uh, that, to me, that's enough right there. I start. Uh, I get Brad Hand up in the bullpen, get him warmed up. So, in comes uh, Wilson Contreras, and he singles up the middle as well. Uh, Judge tries to score, but uh, he's getting hosed at home. So, yeah. Uh, Sano went to third on the throw, so we got runners at first and third with two outs. And then uh, Adam Duvall comes in. I jam him, and I uh, break his bat, and he pops up to the catcher to end the inning. So we get out of that without any issues. So. On to the bottom of the second. Santana comes in, and uh, he finds a pitch to hit. Drills it up the middle for, the, for a base hit. Next up is uh, Jake Lamb, and looking for something to drive, and uh, found a pitch, but I, I didn't get it all, and pretty much just a, a routine fly ball out to center field, so uh, Santana's got to go back to first. Next up, one of my favorite players in the game, Kyle Schwarber. Uh, Looking for something really to drive down the line, but uh, he's trying to pitch around him a bit. Almost hits him there. And I, I, once again, I get pretty solid contact. Another long fly ball to center field. And once again, Santana's got to go back to first. So uh, Next up is uh, Paul DeYoung. And he, 
unfortunately flies out to right field and that is the third out so still no score at the end of two he's got the pitcher in there uh, a little easy line out to the second base at that point uh, I decided I'm gonna go ahead and bring in uh, I'm bringing in Brad hand I just I don't feel comfortable with Paxton and uh, but you know things happen even with Brad hand so he pitches to uh, VR Got him to miss on that first pitch. Missed on that second pitch. There's one of those glitch plays, man. Of course, he is fast, but that's one of the things. Hopefully, they they fixed in the latest update. So, George Springer comes up. Uh, VR steal second, no problem there. And uh, Springer drives one deep to center field. Look for VR to advance on the throw, and he does. And it's close, but he made it in there. So, so hands facing Cody Bellinger, and he gets him on a slider to end the inning. So, yeah, did a good job there to get to finish that up. So, at the bottom of the third, we get uh, Adam Rosales. And the unlikely hero, Adam Rosales, comes up and drives one deep to left field, and it's gone, and we lead one to nothing. And after that, Lincecum settles down, and uh, he gets he gets the next three guys, three up, three down after that. So top of the fourth, uh, we also get three up and three down. No real issues whatsoever. And we move on to the bottom of the fourth. So, in the fourth inning, we got Trumbo up. It's a routine grounder, but VR makes a bad throw into the dirt, and he cannot pick it up. So, he's on base with a E6. Brings up Domingo Santana. And uh, he singles into right so we got runners at first and second I could have probably advanced there but I didn't want to chance it so Jake Lamb comes up I'm hoping for a big big hit here took the first pitch looking for something a little more up in the zone and hits it hard but right into the second baseman who uh, gets, hits him into a double play uh, Santana or a Trumbo made it to third base and uh, Schwarber comes in Wild pitch and in comes the score so we're up two to nothing so And I'm really looking to crank one with Schwarber here. He gets a pitch to hit drills it down the line but uh, yeah, he hooks it foul and then uh, he goes down swinging so and that ends the inning but we got the second run so we're up two to nothing at the time so top of the fifth uh, I'm warming up uh, Fleet Rivera and uh, Adam Duvall comes in to pinch hit and uh, hits a single up the middle so and then uh, Brandon Belt comes in as pinch hitter for Lincecum, and he singles up the middle, so it's first and second. So Jonathan VR comes up. I've already had a couple issues with him. So I'm bringing in Rivera. Another lefty. I don't know why I brought a lefty in at that point, but he's a fantastic pitcher, so I don't really worry about it too much. And... Uh, he kind of there's a shallow fly out to right, and the runners do not advance. So, and probably would have been hosed if he did. So, so we got two outs, and Springer comes up, and uh, Rivera gets him to hit hit a ground ball, gets the force at second, and the and the inning's over. We go to the bottom of the fifth. He brings an Axford in relief. Uh, Paul DeYoung comes in immediately and. Hits one into towards the uh, center, and the guy misplays it. 
Yeah. And he's going to second base. It's They're going to count it a double. It should, really should have been an error, but single and an error. Could have got me there if he was paying attention. Adam Rosales comes in. He had the solo home run earlier, but uh, he gets a curveball out of the zone and he strikes out. So Travis comes in for pinch hit or... Uh, yeah, but he K's on a curveball, got two outs, and then uh, Bradley comes up and he K's for the third out. So, and we bring Asuna in again. Uh, but Cody Bellinger at the plate, dangerous, dangerous hitter, and he almost gets something done, but uh, hit it too low right at the third baseman for a line out. So Aaron Judge comes out. I give. I get a couple strikes ahead of him, and I give him a change up, and he whiffs on the change. So, Jake Lamb comes in, and he promptly doubles. And I did the same thing the other guy did. One of those things when you're using the, the you know, moving the fielder over, the infielder to get the ball, and the outfielder, uh, you know, switches over to the outfielder, and he's going the wrong way. But here comes Sano. Got a one and two count on him. Give him the slurve. And he strikes out. When we win the game, our record goes to six and one. They give Osuna the player of the game, which okay, whatever. But uh, yeah, so we're a record six and one. And uh, let's go look at the. Uh, there's Adam Rosales at the at the uh, the home run that basically the game-winning home run, the game-winning run. So. Okay, there we see we've completed six total wins, so we get another uh, freebie there, which we'll get after the, uh, you know, we get through the, the tournament. After I lose, if I lose the second game, uh, they'll give me those uh, things. So, all right, well, that's going to be it for this episode. If you liked the episode, leave a like. If you have not yet subscribed, I'd appreciate it if you would. And we'll catch you next time on SRD Plays Diamond Dynasty. Thank you.